Okay, front door. But you know, here's something I want to tell you about. What's amazing to me is, I think this is titanium. Door, solid metal door, no rust, no, uh, and of course we're right here on the water. It does have this protective gate door, but it, you can see no rust. <coughs> it's right here, titanium. But here's something that really is something else. When's the, when's the last time you guys even seen this before? Skeleton key. I've not seen one of those until. I mean, I and it's heavy too. It's very heavy. But <clears throat> uh, my, I mean, my mine's in my grandma's house. Uh, but here, here you go. That's it. But anyway, metal door. I painted no rust. They really kept the place up. As you can see, you come in the front door, a cabinet. Of course, we got the door open. We got some snacks. Bed, shower, ours in the shower, couch, chair. That's the vital chair with the pillows, table, <coughs> and chair. And of course, another chair, fan. Uh, and then there's a cabinet at the other end. So it's a really nice room. They call this a double room. They have other rooms. Uh, look at all the wonderful wood, the treatment, the wood. Very clean, very nice. Staff is wonderful. Then, you wake up, you open the front door, and you're straight out here into the, into the, here's the ocean. As you can hear it and how wonderful it is. But as you can see, they got many rooms here. Uh, we're in room four. And if you go down, found my slippers here, I'll kind of give you guys a little better tour. Uh, let me get my slippers on. As you can see, everybody's playing. It's Christmas Eve today. So everybody's out and about having parties and things. So, so as you can see, really pleasant, really nice, comfortable place, very clean. Uh, this resort, I don't know how many people are staying here. I said they were fully booked, if I've not seen but a couple other people. But here you go. Here is where they have parties. They have a reception room upstairs for uh, weddings and uh, parties and receptions. And they have a buffet line over here set up. And then they have cooking outside, dirty kitchen. And then this goes into the other areas of the front. I'll show you that another time. I'm wet from swimming. So uh, here is, here's your views. Isn't this beautiful? Temperature today probably is, I'd say, uh, 75, 77 degrees. I checked earlier this morning, uh, Fahrenheit. You see a boater out there. I don't know if you can see him way out there fishing. But this gives you an idea how nice it is here. Uh, we were just out. Oh, man, the coral, as you can see, the coral. Uh, beautiful fish. Wonderful, wonderful, beautiful tiger, little tiger fish. Uh, a lot of fish I didn't even know the names of. I mean, just really, really just beautiful. We enjoyed it. Water was, of course, warm. How could it not be, right? We're here in the Philippines. But uh, isn't this nice? Uh, over there, I don't, you can't see it. Bahol. Bahol's right there, the island of Bahol. And if you scroll down here, and scroll around the path. Sigihor right there. The island of Sigihor. I don't know if you can see it. See it in the picture. But it's over there. This island ends here. Uh, you go around a bend. It's at about another 45 minutes south. And the island ends. And then you head back up three hours and a half or four hours. And you're back at the top of the island there in Cebu. But <clears throat> I don't know if you noticed. Look how clean, how expensive compared to where we live as far as the houses are more, uh, how, you, how can I say, more uh, nicer. Uh, they utilize everything, water coming off the roof into a barrel. They utilize the water here. It's got a generator on property. <laughs> Look at all that wood. Now that's wood up there. <clears throat> it almost looks teak. I don't know if it's teak or not, but how could you not have, how can you have wood here on the beach and it not rot? So it's got to be a high-end wood. 
maybe a, uh, I forget the name of it here, wood. <clears throat> but that is wood. It's not, it's not aluminum. I checked it. <laughs> it said that's wood. I know that's wood for sure right there on those stairs. <clears throat> but you can see, and then there's a walkway there to the beach. Uh, here's where they have buffet set up. Uh, another apartment style home. I think family live there. I don't know. Parking garage for car. They have another parking garage up, fr up front for three cars. The gentleman owns this is a is a German. His name is uh, Adolf, and he has been here for quite a few years. And uh, he's done a really good job on this property. Him and his wife. <coughs> we Ruth and I actually met some uh, <coughs> people in town yesterday. Uh, they were from California, another couple from Texas, Filipino and Filipina. A lot, a lot, a lot of American Filipino here who live here. Uh, we, all we did was went to watch the town, and uh, before you know it, we talked to the lady, and she said, oh, where are you from? Oh, California. Uh, so they're here. They're having a party tonight. We're invited, of course. Really nice couple. But even if you look at the... You can't really see it, but if you look at the light up there, no rust. Man, I'm in Daytona Beach, Ormond Beach, Jacksonville, Fort Lauderdale, Miami, Miami Beach. Man, many a nights in Miami Beach. High-end places. But you've never seen a light stand even like that at the high-end places. They're not rusted to pieces. The light post and the light. Uh, kudos out, a shout out to this people and how they keep this place spot on. The lights themselves, even the brackets for the lights, no rust. I don't know if they change them out once a year. I don't know. I don't know. Even the bars on the windows, no rust. They look brand new. Look at that light up there. It looks like a brand new light. So, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, no coconut. Uh, Chich said they used all the coconut blooms for tuba, the tuba wine, coconut wine. So those trees will never produce any more uh, coconuts anymore. Same on those other trees. And they do that for a reason because here you don't want to have uh, a coconut falling on your head as you're eating a buffet. You know, chicken wing. <laughs> Food is good here, uh, very good. Everything you would want, hamburgers, uh, french fries, pizza, we had pizza, but it had vegetarian pizza, it had uh, potato on it, it was good actually. The way they did it, they uh, actually uh, deep fried the potato and then uh, put it on the grill, stuck it on that pizza, it's not bad. But. How can you beat this? I'm doing a longer video because I've been doing so many short videos. I've been using the iPhone on the short videos uh, only because it was just the opportunity. This phone's been, uh, battery was low on it for a long time. So. Isn't it nice? Of course, there's many other wonderful places to stay, many other wonderful places, but I think anywhere in the Philippines you want to go, you can have fun. I think it's just an island of fun, enjoyment, and just enjoy yourself. And not worry about it. You know, you see all the kids out there playing. They said, uh, oh, Americano, Americano. <laughs> so, Americano. Yeah, it's enjoyable just to watch this, right? It's like uh, someone said with the whatever, just uh, set listen to Christmas music on uh, Christmas Eve. Uh, Ruth and I and I want to wish everybody a Merry Christmas and a <clears throat> Happy New Year. And I want everybody to really enjoy themselves and have a prosperous year uh, this year coming up and a healthy year for everybody. 
want to thank everybody for always subscribing and watching our videos. And my channel and Ruth's channel. And we want to thank you for that. I think they got some crab traps out there, lobster traps set up. I see a lot of these little things. But fishermen were out this morning banging on the boats with lights, making noise and blowing a horn. And I think it must attract the fish. I don't know. Up this morning about 5 a.m. doing that. Look how beautiful that water is. Okay, thank everybody for watching. Uh, thank you, thank you for watching.